Um, hi there, this is just a quick update um, for... Hi there, I haven't updated the... Hi there, this is just a quick uh, project update for Vibrant Highland Commercial Love. I am... it's around 11, 12 at night, I don't know, sometime in early November and um, this is what I've been doing for the past month. Um, and this is also the reason for for all the project delays. Um, this is the animation I'm building for the film. And just to give you an idea of the very tedious process that this involves, this is one of the easiest setups I've done for the film. There's about six minutes of animation and the way this works is essentially we move the, we cut out a shape from cardboard and then we, by we I mean I, uh, move it a millimeter or a few millimeters at a time per frame and um, in one second of video there's 24 frames although I've cheated and I've shot some of this at 15 frames which um, which still looks okay and I have about six minutes of animation in the film um, pretty complex animation so um, so you can imagine this takes some time um, but anyways the way this works is I have I found this fabric this is actually some kind of office um, office folder that I found that was semi-transparent um, with this kind of weird texture-ish thingy and I cut that up um, and that's semi-transparent so that gives the impression that um, that these cutout mountains are further away and the rest is just cardboard um, they're Vina Taba tobacco um, cardboard boxes and I cut out different shapes from them and then there's um, thinner thinner cardboard down below to make little houses and whatnot and then I have the whole thing set up on my Konova slider so that I can move it easily well sort of easily more easily than without it and there's a ruler so I have to calculate to the millimeter what I'm doing and there's my spreadsheets which go back for all the different shots and um, yeah this goes pages and pages back yeah this is this was about two seconds all those numbers that you see um, yeah anyways um, and you can see I didn't have proper supplies so I had to prop this whole setup up on this side um, with books and DVDs and pretty much anything else that I could find around the house and um, yeah this is this shot is one before the last but I screwed things up a little bit so I need to go ahead and redo it um, which I'm not very happy about but um, but it is what it is. Here's my camera, also propped up on DVDs because my crappy tripod is too tall. Actually, I love my tripod. And um, yeah, that's um, <coughs> that's what I'm working on. Um, it's probably another two, three days of manual labor for me, and then computer work to make this look nicer and. I'm crossing my fingers that after all these delays, um, hopefully by the end of November, the film will be finished. Alright, thanks for watching and um, make sure to check back in a little bit. Um, I do have the trailer nearly done and there's some um, donation videos and behind the, scene videos, behind the scenes videos that I will also be um, putting out. So, um, so do check back. Thanks.